instead of having to plug in a USB charger or a smart plug. Wouldn't it be nice to have USB charging ports and smart plugs all built into the outlet? You can with this Lumeri Smart Outlet. They're easy to install and set up too. Hi, this is David of Tech for Baba, a channel I share my experiences on how technology enhances my time with kids and family as a dad. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please consider subscribing to the channel. In today's video, let's check out the Lumeri Smart Outlet, see if it's easy to install and use. Not only does each outlet has two USB charging ports, it can be controlled by an app from anywhere with internet connection, or by a voice assistant like Alexa and Google Assistant without needing an extra hub. I have the four pack here, but they're also sold individually. Inside the box, there are the four outlets. Underneath, There is a small instruction manual, four wire label stickers, four sets of screws, and four face plates. Let's take a closer look at the outlet. In the front, it has two plugs like most outlets. These are rated 10 amps each with a maximum of 15 amps together. There are two 5V USB-A ports. Each can go up to 2.1 amps, but only 2.1 amps total between the two. This reset button in the center also works as an on and off button for the outlet. The back is much bulkier than a normal outlet as expected. That's why Luminary recommends a junction box with depth greater than 2.36 inches. Just like a normal outlet, there are three wires to connect. One hot, one neutral, and one ground wire. Okay, let's get it installed and set up. First, be sure to turn off the power to the outlet. Test it with the tester to make sure it's indeed off. Remove the two screws holding the cover plate. Then the two screws holding down the existing outlet. As I pull this out, you can see the hot wire, usually in black, and the neutral wire, usually in white, along with the ground wire, usually in exposed copper. If you like, stick on these stickers accordingly before removing the wires from the old outlet. I usually don't since it's not too hard to tell them apart. Now let's connect the wires to the luminary outlet. Loosen the side screws first. Then insert the strip black hot wire into the hole on the right. And tighten down the side screw. Then the white neutral wire into the hole on the left. And tighten down the side screw. Loosen the screw for the ground wire on the bottom. There is no hole for the ground wire, so wrap the wire around the screw and tighten. Push the wires in, then secure the outlet to the junction box with the two longer screws. One on the top and the other on the bottom. Then use the two shorter screws to attach the faceplate. That's it! Turn the power to the outlet back on. The USB port and the plug should all work now. This center button works as the on-off button and indicator for the outlet. To control the outlet with an app or voice assistant, we need to connect the outlet to the app first. To do that, download and open the Luminary app. There are two connection modes. Press and hold the reset button in the center for 5 seconds. The indicator light will first flash rapidly for the easy connection mode. Press and hold the reset button again for 5 seconds. The indicator light will flash slowly and the outlet is now in the AP connection mode. I find the AP connection mode easier to connect to. In the app, on the top corner, click the plus button. Choose the device to be added, Luminary Smart Outlet, go to Add, Bluetooth Device, enter the Wi-Fi password. The app will connect to the outlet.
Oh, and there is a new device firmware. So let's update it now. Start update. Takes about 45 seconds. Once connected, the app can be used to turn on or off the two plugs and the two USB ports together. Let's turn on switch 2, which is connected to this light. Turning it off, the outlet could also be controlled with a voice assistant like Alexa. Alexa, turn on switch 2. At about $27 each and $90 for the 4-pack, the Luminary Outlet is a great way to automate the home. It's a good integration of smart USB ports and smart switches in an outlet. Nice and clean without any charging bricks or smart plugs dangling from an outlet. It's easy to install and set up too. I'll have a link to it with discounts from time to time in the description below. Thanks for watching. If you find this video helpful, please support me by hitting that like button and sharing this video with your friend. What smart plugs or outlets have you tried at your home? I'd love to know in the comment section below. If you want to see more videos on how technology can enhance our life with kids and family, please subscribe and turn on the bell to be notified when I put out my next video. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, remember to cherish each moment. Alexa, turn off switch 2.